Hello, my friends. Welcome to a place of belonging. Today, I invite you to take a walk with me and my little ones into the woods. And while we walk, I'd like you to meditate with me. Listen to the sound of my steps. See my daughter exploring. She knows nothing of the troubles we're seeing today. I can't help but look at her now and envy her freedom, her lack of burden. Today's meditation guide word is childlike. When I think of the word childlike, these words also come to my mind. Adventurous, curious, imaginative, trusting, watched over, safe, carefree. Perhaps the reason childhood seems so magical is because as a child, you care about nothing except that which is in the very present moment. When I was a girl, I came up with a rhyme to help me through a rough season my family was going through. It was during the 2008 economic crisis. Not only did we lose our business, but my mother was so ill, she had to remain in bed. The rhyme was, they have the worry, I have the fun, as long as I do what has to be done. I made this silly rhyme to remind myself to take care of my responsibilities but to not mentally carry the entire weight of the extreme situation we found ourselves in. That burden was too heavy for me to carry. Presently in 2020, I find myself in a similarly unsettling situation. In fact, we all do. We're on a wild ride. We don't know the twists and turns ahead. We don't know when the ride will stop. Now an adult woman and a mama, I keep trying to jump ahead, to make plans, to solve all the problems. But every time I do, it ends in frustration. It's as if I've carefully crafted a well-cleared path on an Etch-a-Sketch, and then some invisible force carelessly comes along, picks it up, and gives it a vigorous shake. I think I can learn something today from my younger self. Today I have my responsibilities, but the weight of what's happening in the world is not for me to carry. Today, as we meditate on what it means to be childlike, may we be reminded to not jump too far ahead. May we be reminded to not carry the weight of the world, but focus on our own part to play, which for many of us is staying home. Like a child, may we only concern ourselves with the very present moment. Jesus had once told his disciples, Therefore, do not be anxious about tomorrow, for tomorrow will be anxious for itself. Sufficient for the day is its own trouble. That's recorded in Matthew chapter 6, verse 34. Dear friends, linger here. Soak in the sights and sounds of nature. Release any guilt you may feel. For giving up the burden of worry. And any time you find yourself worrying about tomorrow, may you meditate on what it means to be childlike. May you remember the words of Jesus. And may you decide not to take on more than what is presented in the present moment. Thank you for taking a walk with me today. Stay a while.